Alright, welcome back. Last time Yuna was attacked, and uh, everybody was fawning over her, so Titus was going to take a walk. This is Wolf the Fallen, and we're going to walk for dramatic effect. Just so you know, uh, I'm playing this, I'm using a guide, but I'm also, I'm using the official guide, and I'm playing from memory, so I don't know everything. I, 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 you know, I just play how I remember playing, so. Titus, don't get excited. Actually, I guess Riku. she wouldn't be underage to you. You're Riku. Uh, hey! Oh, jailbait, guys. Hey! Stop thinking. Anyways, as I was saying, I, I, I'm just playing through memory and yeah, you using so the strategy good. guide once in a while. You uh, beat I remember where number? most of the Albed huh? primers are, but not all all of them. Oh, so I'm using the guide Machina? mostly. That was you. Um, as for like a lot of the tactics and stuff, they're just how I play. I, you don't necessarily have to play how I play. There, there are tons of tact, uh, ways to play out there. Different ways make the game different, more enjoyable. And I think that's why Final Fantasy gets LP'd the most. Because there's so many different ways people can play. Like, I'm not very strategic in my playing. I'm more beat the living crap out of somebody as quickly as possible. Yuna, Lulu. Yeah. I so everybody remember, remember Riku? She was the one who helped me before I was washed up on Besaid. Bet, bet, She's bet, now bet, 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 bet. Way to spoil it, Titus. It's where uh, Waka's brilliance uh, shines. Wow. So you like? Oh, you like? Waka, you holy here, huh? crap, man. Crazy Are you that stupid, you Waka? He's really stone-headed, isn't he? Well, anyways, everybody remember Riku? Oh, uh, Riku. She's good friend. Like we haven't seen up, her for a while. Okay. I mean, almost Waka. halfway through the uh, huh? her journey what? before we get to see There's her again. Yeah, we. Oh, go ahead. Yeah. Girls only. Boys, what? Please wait Can't over be there. girls only. Right. That's Sorry, sexist. Waka. Sexist. Huh? What? Guys should be allowed to get in on the conversation. Why not? What's going on? What are you guys talking about? Boobies, bow, and tassels. What the hell are those things on her back? Will they make her more aerodynamic or something? I would like Riku to be my guardian. Why is she even asking Orin? I don't know why. It's not like Orin has the choice. Show you know, it's the one who chooses. Huh? Look at me. Oh, okay. Open your eyes. As I thought. Yeah, I'll bet have funky looking eyes. I'm guessing it's from. Uh, no good. Living where they live. Are you certain? Hundred percent. The pupil, pupils are all spirally. I don't know how you would see through that. Can I? Like, would your world be like you're you drunk or something? It? Yes. Constantly I do. drunk scene. Riku's a good girl. She helped me yeah. a bunch. Yeah. Come on, Waka. Everybody you enjoy do. it. Kamari don't care. Well, I'm Kamari just stands back there. The more the merrier. He's simply the guy on the journey, simply to have another player. It was strange. Even though Waka had always hated the Albed. Riku, at your service. He never realized Riku was yeah, one of them. She, she's rather perky and kind of annoying, but you know what? She's not as perky and annoying as she is in, the, in this game as she is in the second one. So here we have a force battle, where we'll learn about one of her unique skills. Yes, it is. I wonder what's inside. Well, let us find out. Treasure chest. So, when you see a treasure chest in battle, go to special, go to steal, and steal it. If you, it only has one HP. So, if you attack it, it will blow up. Yahoo! Well, this pair won't blow up. So, we got two bomb cores and a big thing with warts on it came attack. You should know. I'm scary when I get mad. No, you're just annoying. I'm use that item I just got on you. You'll be sorry. Yeah, shut the hell up. So, Final Fantasy Veterans mix works pretty much the same in here. It is this does take two items and mix them together. 
or are they? Two bomb cores. Mix them together. Firestorm, basically a lot like Lulu's uh, Fury. Fury spell. She uses her overdrive. You, you can use different kinds of one, but they pretty much make it mimic different spells and stuff like that. And they're more effective. I don't use it that often, mostly because I don't remember... I don't remember every mixing spell off I heard. I'm sorry, people. I, I don't remember the, all of them. Mostly because a lot of them are just useless and don't really care. I, I just don't care about mixing. I'm not saying the alchemy class isn't good, just... The mixing thing I don't do unless I absolutely have to. I don't like using up a lot of element uh, items. So this path here is fairly short. I still get attacked on it though. But it's mostly the same enemies from before. Uh, but this one, it has a chest, so I'll briefly show it. Waka, take him down. So you don't want to finish off. Oh. You don't want to finish off the enemy before getting the chest. So you want to get the chest first. Riku, come on, Riku. I'll do my best. This is about the only thing she's good for. I mean, right now, yeah. Look at her HP is awful. I mean, one hit from some of these enemies, and she's down for the count. So you don't want her to use her, you only want her to steal and then get the hell out of battle. And she probably has the fastest agility out of the group. Like, she'll take two turns in a row very easily compared to some other people. I think her and Walker are the only two that will really do that. Pretty much as soon as you bring her into battle, have, yeah, as I was saying, as soon as you bring her into battle, have her, depending on what she does, uh, you'll be able to take her out of battle right after, like, her turn will be the, almost the next turn. So that could be useful. Uh, you'll be able to cure her, to cure somebody, and then pull her out right away. So let's head to Guado Salam. Yeah, Yuna hasn't learned the healing ability yet. I, I guess I'm not doing it as enough. Usually she should have learned it by Jose. I should. You should be learning a lot of them by Jose. I mean, even Titus, I, I haven't learned, uh... We Slice and dice, the second, uh, Welcome the second overdrive. This way, my lady. This What's way. going on? Whoa, uh, uh, whoa, whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! 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 Oh, whoa. I beg your pardon. Damn, what are you guys doing? I am called Trommel Guado. Good evening, Trommel. service of our leader, the great Seymour Guado. Seymour? Lord Seymour, Seymour has asses? Any important business with Lady Yuna. Uh, business what business? Whatever could it be, I wonder. Yeah, exactly. Please, uh, come inside the manor. All will be explained. Of course, uh, you're creeping your me out, buddy. Friends are also welcome. Yeah, all the Guado are fairly creepy. Twist our arms, why don't you? Ah, I almost forgot. All right. Customizing, basically any items you find in battle. You notice that some of the weapons have empty slots there. When you find items in battle, you s go to customize, select the item, the equi piece of equipment, uh, select the item, and you'll be able to add uh, abilities. So like bomb fragments, we'll add the fire strike, electro marble, and there's other things too, you can add strength, M MP, HP, defense, magic defense, different types of strikes, stuff like that, change the names, so you, you can customize your weapons. Certain weapons will not let you what customize. You uh, what? So, customize, and... Go for the noxious guys. Actually, let's go for this move over here. Uh, yeah, so, there we go. Now, if you go to equipment, Lulu, select the mo magical model, and she now has 3% uh, more magic power to it. 
Well, let's just take a look around. There's some houses in here. And right about here somewhere, you'll find aisle bed primer number 13. Okay, interesting. So you can talk to people, a lot of the people you see here are mostly, they're not very interesting. Uh, you see a lot of, uh, a lot of the like, Waddle Blitzball teams running around, stuff like that. Like there's one now. See, they don't have much to say. Weapons and armor. Uh, most of the time you won't need to equip them. Like buy them, because See, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna need them better sooner, that's still better. Uh, that's a little better. Or no, mine's a little better, never mind. Oh, shit, well, I just made that. Oh, I'm gonna buy that one. That's better, I'm gonna buy that. Uh, if you want, buying the yellow stuff is a very smart idea. I'm not gonna do that, because I don't wanna waste the money. What you doing here, Awaka? Thank you. Yeah, a lot of his stuff's a little more expensive. Let's see how he's doing. Oh, I have no reason. One. These Guado merchants are shrewd. They are indeed. Ripping off the pilgrims that come to visit the fire plane. Listen, you watch that they don't get you too. I won't. Me, you can trust. More than a guado, at least. What do you say? Uh, nothing. I think he sells the same item, but... Yeah, they're a little more expensive at the guado place, so if you're gonna get them, buy them from Owaka. Uh, Alright. Not much really done in this episode. No, there's a door here. I'll sh show you what's in here. Nothing interesting. More people. Yeah, just more people talking. Nothing interesting. Blah 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 blah. Oh, other side down. Down here. Don't worry, I see those treasure chests. Head into the inn here. I know that you can't read that sign. It's an inn. And uh, here's our buddy Meacham. Care to hear about the far plane or the fireflies? Well, let's hear about the uh, far plane. Ahem. The far plane is the place where fireflies born from ascending gather. Mm -hmm. They appear in the shape of people who've died and gone to the far plane. Interesting. Quite the phenomenon. How I wish I understood it more fully. They don't really they explain it very well, but... theory, you know. They say the fireflies are just reacting to visitors' thoughts and dreams. But mm -hmm. only the dead appear on the far plane. No image of the living has ever been seen. It's a great mystery, but maybe... Maybe the dead leave a bit of themselves in the hearts of the living. Maybe. And that little bit borrows the firefly's power for their paranormal performance. Or maybe not, who knows. I'm guessing and that as they, say, they leave like that. when somebody dies and they perform ascending, they probably have a little bit of electromagnetic or something the that plane? the fireflies fire absorb. Fly. Let's learn about the fireflies. They may be called fireflies, but they aren't really flies, you see. No? There, those lights you see whenever a fiend dies. Yeah, I noticed that. See, at least this Final Fantasy gives an explanation as to why the fiends disappear, or enemies fiends disappear. Past. Spheres, fiends, these are all the fireflies. So the fire fireflies ba basically fact, hold fireflies memories to do with too. and thoughts. So they're they like little energy generators. And that which is unreal little, uh, becomes real for all to Like see. Star Trek, they're like little or photon and light that thingies. Say, is that able to turn a hologram into real life. Oh, how very is Sir Guardian? Pretty good. It seems that Maester Seymour has returned to Guado Salam. Well, that's good. He's young, but he deserves our respect. Well, I guess you're kind of right. So, if Didis will stop right there, we go. So, uh, I think I'm gonna leave it here. 
thank you folks for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode where some big plot points, little twisters will happen. Thank you, and have a good day. Bye.